Philadelphia's Center works to empower people living with HIV and to prevent new transmissions. NBC6's Lynn Vance shares how the center enhances our community's wellness, and that's something good. The Philadelphia Center was established in 1990 to respond to the HIV AIDS epidemic in Shreveport, Bossier. The center has evolved to now include testing, education, and treatment for not only HIV, but many other sexually transmitted infections. For our PrEP clinic and our post-exposure clinic, anyone, doesn't matter the sex, the gender, the race, um, we service all people through those clinics. All of our services here at the Philadelphia Center are free of charge. The center also provides outreach education and testing in the community. You can find the testing van at health fairs, churches, and community events. We go anywhere where someone invites us to come in and do education. People who have been diagnosed HIV positive are assigned a case manager to help with many things, including but not limited to housing, medication, and food. If they're focused on lack of housing or food insecurity or their mental health or their substance use, they're not able to focus on their their physical needs or on their HIV or, or whatever else is going on. I'm holding tickets to the auction against AIDS, the Philadelphia Center's largest fundraiser, because fundraising is important for this organization. I hope that everybody will come, so not only is your ticket buying you a fun night with a lot of really cool people, but it's also going to fund the amazing things that the Philadelphia Center does in this community. For NBC6, I'm Lynn Vance. Great organization and great event. Lynn talks in depth with Sam about what people can expect at this year's auction against AIDS. You can find that bonus content on KTALnews.com under the KTAL Cares tab.